Hey guys, it's Ozzy Halen here. It's been a while, hasn't it? So, um, I'm starting up a new Let's Play, uh, hopefully a successful one. I think this will be a fun one to do. Because, if you haven't already told, or not told, saw by now, you would know what game I'm playing if you know. Um, well, we're going to be playing Paper Mario today, but we're going to have a little twist on it. What we're going to do is we're going to do a low-leveled run with BP only. What I mean by that is every time I level up, because it's impossible to not level up in this game. There's certain enemies you have to fight. But anyway, those enemies though, if I level up, it's only going to BP. I'm only allowed to use BP, and I can only fight bosses that are necessary. So this should be an interesting one, shouldn't it? Okay, so we're paying attention to this backstory here. And then... What the? Who stuck that weird thing into this story? Just like the scotch tape. Oh, ha ha! Yeah, I did. Wow, you're you're dastardly using scotch tape to your advantage. Who knew that scotch tape was so evil? Take this star rod. Do it, Cammy Cooper. Blah 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 blah. Excalibur. And no, you mustn't do that. <gasps> They stole a stick with a star on it! How dare those dastardly villains! And now he's changing him into his poker set. I guess he has a game going on tonight, high stakes, so I guess he needed some kind of star power to help him. Couldn't find one, one of those question block boxes. So that's the story. Now Star Kids may rise to the hate and deliver people's wishes. Those wishes will not come true. Whatever can they do? Dang it. And I was wishing for a cocaine filled hooker to come by my door. That won't happen. We're playing Paper Mario. Ooh, it has been a while since I played this. Whew. <laughs> yeah. Well, da 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 da. I hardly remember any of these files. So I'm just gonna erase. Uh. Yeah, let's just erase file. Alright. Don't worry about these. These are spoilers, I guess. Not really. Enter a name. Let's see. Let's just put. Ozzy. Start the game. Mail call. Hey Mario, we got a letter from the Princess Peach. I'll read it to you, okay? Alright, let's see. I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you both could attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you here soon. Sincerely, Peach. I'm still waiting for my cake. <sighs> Promise me cake in 64. I got it. And now you're introduced to the main hub world. This is pretty much where everything goes on. Toad Town. Uh, I think this is the first time they actually showed Toad Town in the game, but. Yeah, it's pretty standard. It's not really an exciting town, I guess. They need more parties. Need some raves. Some dubstep. Now, whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah, see, this is all fancy. It's like royalty parties. It's like, oh, spot a tea. Why can't we have some, like, raving dubstep? Like, wow, wow, wow. Tripping ecstasy. 
What a magnificent castle. I'll never get used to this place. It looks like lots of guests are already here. Oh, and now we can walk around. So, uh, basic controls. A is jump. B does nothing for now. We'll get into that. Start does nothing for now. We'll also get into that. Control stick moves, obviously. Control pad does absolutely nothing like most Nintendo 64 games. C buttons do... The up C button brings down your uh, status bar, and the other C buttons we'll get into later. L and R we'll get into later. And Z? If you're running while you do it, you can spin! If you stand still, you just spin and spikes. So, yeah. Go up to people when you see that bubble, you can just talk to them. Welcome to Peach's Castle. Ah, salutation, Mario. Did you know Frosty here? He's come all the way from Shiver Region, which lies far to the north. Oh, well, uh, nice to meet you. I don't want to talk to you again. I find spinning a good way to get past a lot of things, especially when you can't run very fast. Um, so lots of interesting people here. There's no one really to talk to. Although this guy is fun to talk to. This is Princess Peach's room, but I'm afraid she isn't here at the moment. Huh? Oh no, absolutely not! I don't think it's very polite to go into a room without asking for Mario. I said no, and that means no, you are simply not allowed to go in there. I said no, and that means no! Boy, you're persistent. I guess I have no choice. Hurry up in there though, and don't touch anything. Haha! <laughs> Sucker! Let's look for a panty drawer. Ew! It's brown! I'm getting out of here. How was it? To tell you the truth, I've never seen the inside of her room. She has brown panties, so you don't really want to go in there. I mean, think about it. Taking those things off, you'd be like, Oh, baby, yeah, uh, uh, uh. Okay, so just make our way up the castle to go meet Princess Peach up at the top. Meeting our damsel in distress, although she's not in distress. Yet. Knowing this game, it's a Mario game. She's gonna be in distress soon. Sorry to be ninja. Wah. There she is! Oh. She's a... She has weird eyes. She noticed me! Dang it. Not that ninja, apparently. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Nobody would bother us here. Shall we relax and chat, just the two of us? Oh, I know what they're gonna do. Bomb chicka, get your head out of the gutter. It was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out on the balcony right now. Would you accompany me, Mario? Cool. Oh, uh, what? Earthquake, get down! Whoa. Those trees are, uh, pretty papery. Who could this... Who could have done this? Really? See, you see clowns. You see fortresses. You see a big lizard head. I've got no idea. <sighs> oh, are you alright, Mario? What in the world was that? Oh my, look, Mario, it's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see stars outside. Boom! Rude awakening. Gwahahaha! <laughs> A no long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser? This can't be! It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? <laughs> yeah, that was me. I lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle now. Weren't expecting that, huh? Castle on a castle? Castleception. Ha! <laughs> this castle is under my control now, my dear. Now you will obey me! Huh? What? Oh, it's... it's Mario. What, what a shock. 
Ha, <laughs> <laughs> no, not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Fortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? Huh. Nintendo advertising Bowser to give up mean that they lose about... No. I'd say about... Uh, $250 million worth of stuff. True, true. I've had my problems in the past. This time is different. How is it different? You build some big castle, kidnap the princess, get your butt whooped. This time I'm gonna win. Oh, uh, that, that's a winner's attitude. Okay, tough guy, let's go. And this is the introduction of battle. Mario, you can do it. Yeah. In case you haven't noticed, uh, Paper Mario is an RPG game. It's turn-based. Uh, well, we have three options here. These are grayed out because we can't use them for now because we don't have anything to really do besides fight him. And we don't have any items with us. So we can jump on him. Pick it. Select. Ta-da! Now he attacks me. I can't do nothing about it right now. Clunk. Bang. Yeah, this is exciting, isn't it? Uh. Good old Mario, always fighting. You're a thorn in my side. But today, your pathetic little attacks won't beat me. Take a look at this. Look what I stole from Star Haven. It's a Star Rod. This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world. When I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat Mario. Gwahaha, <laughs> how do you like that, Mario? Ooh, and now you see that's starting to hurt by triple. He's increased his defenses, so my, uh... One power attack does nothing. <laughs> Is that all you got? How sad. You best take some vitamins because that didn't hurt at all. And I'm stuck. I can't do anything. Yep, just as I expected. Mario's no match for the newbie. It's not even worth my time to toy with you anymore, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario. Good night! Whopping 10. Oh, our very first battle. We lost. Oh no, Mario, get up! Yeah, oh yeah, I did it! I finally did it! Beat my old rival, yeah! That's what I would think you would say. Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness. That's why you're the king. As long as I have this star rod, everything I wish will come true. No one can stop me now. Well, well, well. I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. Boom! <gasps> Bowser changed his Pokemon type. Instead of being a fire type, he's an electric type now. Oh no, Mario! Bowser used thunder. It was super effective. And that's the intro. This game is set up like a chapter book. A prologue, a plea from the stars.
Oh, thank heavens, he's been gravely injured, but I think he'll recover. But Bowser has the Star Rod, now he's mightier than Mario. It's hopeless, all is lost. Everybody just calm down, as long as we can keep it together, there's always hope. Now, our fates are in Mario's hands. Must try to revive him. Gather round, everyone. Send Mario your power. Phew, that's it. That's all we can do for now. Mario, please get up. Please. It really sounded like something fell somewhere around here. Oh, who could that be? This red shirt, this hat, and this mustache. You know, this really looks like the one and only Mario. Couldn't be, could it? The real Mario? Hey, hey, wake up! Wake up! Come on! Up and at him! Come on! Oh no, he won't wake up! Oh, oh, wh wh what am I gonna do? Dad, Koopa, Mario! Mario, can you hear me, Mario? I'm an star, a star spirit. I have something very important to tell you. Concerns the princess and all of the Mushroom Kingdom. Sadly, I haven't the strength to talk to you here. Mario, I need to have you come to Shooting Star Summit. Please, Mario, we Star Sprites, the Star Spirits will be waiting for you at the summit. Oh, Mario! So happy to see you awake! You haven't opened your eyes for days and days. Everyone's been worried sick. This place? This is Goomba Village. It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town. The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas. The Goombas in the family are just the nicest folks you'll ever meet. They're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you here to get better. Huh? A star with a mustache? You're saying a star told you to go to Shooting Star Summit? No, I saw nothing like that. I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of this house. I wonder, Mario. Maybe you just had a dream. Although maybe not, it could have been some sort of message from a star spirit. They live in Star Haven. Shooting Star Summit is the nearest place to Star Haven, so that would make sense. Who knows? In any case, I'm glad to see you recovered. I know the Goombas would be happy if you paid them a visit. Alright. Now we're in the first uh, village that we can actually go to. And I think, uh, I think we've done enough for now. So, until next time... Oh, better go over this. This is a save block. This is the only way you can save in the game. I hate when you can't save at any point in the game. It gets frustrating. But, this is what it does. The game is over, your status will return to what it was the last time you saved, and you can continue to play. When you find this block along the way, remember to hit it to save. Do you want to save? Yep. Save completed. Alright, we'll see you guys later, okay? Bye.